Hello and welcome back to another my tutorial. Today I'm going to be um, introducing you to Mental Ray, which is NVIDIA's rendering software for Maya. So, um, alright, so let's go uh, to polygons here. And let's say we have this little triangle right here, and we have a cube maybe, and a plane that these dudes will be on. And if we render this, um, let's say, do. If we were to render this, I'm going to turn that off right now using, make sure I'm on Maya software, yep, okay, and render that. It looks pretty horrible, there's no shadows. We could of course just go to lights and like directional light or something, um, just do that and render it to get some shadows. They're pretty bad though and Maya software isn't the best. So let's see, we want to render this actually well. So what we can do is we can, instead of doing Maya software, we can change this to Mental Ray. Alright, and then click Render again. And, as you can see, it's starting to look a tiny bit better. But it's not that great yet because we don't have any lights. So what we can do is we can actually go back to the render settings and go to Scene. And we can either have Image Space Lighting or Physical Sun and Sky. I'll show both of these. Um, so let's create a Physical Sun and Sky and I'll move that out a bit um, and render this once more uh, once it's done okay it's done. Mental Array takes um, a lot longer to render than uh, Maya software but as you can see it's worth it because look at this amazing image we have as you can see our sun was going down and hitting that and it kind of shadows over that because this cubes in the shadow except for like you know kind of the little top part so now I'm going to show you some HDR lighting instead so if we go to the render settings again we can just delete our physical sun and sky and we can create image based lighting so I'm going to create that and I'm going to get an HDR file so I'm going to go to where I have you can find oh, my HDR file. You can find some of these um, for free, just at our website. Just type in free HDR. That's kind of how I found this one. But anyways, I'll click open, and then we can close out of this, and we can click emit light. So this actually works. Okay, now if we try and uh, render this again, um, okay, it's done. We can see that it looks a lot better, and we have our HDR. Um, doing the lighting and sorts. So that's one thing you can do in there. Um, okay, so I'm gonna actually do just a tiny bit more here for our simple render and I'm gonna delete that plane and uh, go back into our mental rage thing right here. Go to advanced. I'm gonna make this resolution high. Give this, I don't know, like 10 samples. Um, quality, I'll make that like, I don't know, 10 let's say press enter and I'll render this now and we'll see if we can see a difference in how well this looks I'll do it from a different angle as well so I'll pause and come back when it's actually done rendering okay so Maya actually crashed while I tried to render that so um, you can kind of see what I was doing anyways and that is the basics to rendering stuff using mental ray so I guess please subscribe and thanks for watching